Hello, welcome to another video, and today we've got a nice bin. We've got this bin here full of items. Somebody packed it, I have no clue what's in here, so let's open it. And a Beatles book. Okay, and in the end, the last days of the Beatles. Ken McNabb, record collector, four stairs. Nine pounds. Polygon books. The Beatles lit up in the 60s like a comet. Blazing trail. Okay, that might be interesting. Neat. It's quite long as well. Great index. That means I can go to all my favourite W's. Next one. Oh. It's a matchbox cow from 1992. Limited edition MLB. Athletics. Um, What team? Oh, the, um, Oakland Athletics. It's quite nice. Collectible, collect all 28 teams. Well, got a stout. That's quite nice. I mean, is the cow any good? Oh, the wheel's a bit jammed. Yeah, that's all right, though. Let's go with... Um, Backlife CD. Is it in there? It's quite heavy. Oh, yep. Yeah. Well, interesting. It's quite a good album, I think. I haven't heard it in a bit. I might listen to it again. Um, a Potato Head. Right, so, um, so you take, if you don't know what these are, what are you doing? Everybody has one of these, right? Uh, so you can mix and match and terrify. Okay, so I have some lips on the side, some eyes on the bottom. Sure. And um, that's our nose, that's, that's a hat. And look at that. What a wonderful creature. Oh, and these ones have a compartment in the back for smuggling drugs, I guess. Um, a ocarina. A dead ocarina. So cool. These eyes look cool, I saw them. This one has the Nintendo 64 buttons. Yes, it's not a real one, it's plastic. Plays tunes, I think. Is this another CD? Nope, it's a Peter Kay's Phoenix Knights Series 2. I think we took a look at this once. It's, this is a knockoff one, and they took the box out for Series 1 and just stuck some Series 2 stuff on it, it seems. And it's also printed out on paper, and the DVD is recordable. Lovely. Um, a Harry Potter chocolate fog box from the making of Harry Potter in England. Oh, it's out of date too. 5th of December 2018. It's still good, right? Nothing in there. You don't think you care to stay, sadly. Well, so cool. Next item is Match of the Wooden Soldiers, some terrible public domain version. Seems to be from a library as well. Yeah, this is um very some weird sepia posters pictures, and inside is the disc with a tail tail cover, and it also contains the short hustling for health. All you want, really. Um. Okay. Some Reservoir Dogs thing about Mr. Pink. Real name not known. Okay then. Oh, two items here. Grandpa Simpson. Let's see if we can balance him here. Grandpa fell over. Do you know what? We'll put the cow there. Yeah. 
And this seems to be a Harry Potter box, sweet box. Very empty. It's light and empty, I think, but it's great. What's this? Oh, um, Jimi Hendrix, all the hits. Is it in here? Yeah, it is. Some Jimi Hendrix with some mold. Um, so, right, we just. That's a cassette. Great. No, I can't put there. Let's see if we can. Another! Who fight Roger Rabbit as taught by Roger? So, is this like. The film voiced over by Roger Rabbit? It's quite short. Can't be the full film. So I'm going through these up so quick, I can't really say too much about some of them. A, um, oh! Complete the potato head. No, that doesn't work. Yeah. That looks quite good. A, um, this thing again, a knockoff Tato Game Boy. It's Sort of a knockoff game by with a Tato Crisp stamp in there. That's not a sticker, so that's in the plastic. Anyhow, let's play a game with it. I can't see oncoming traffic. I crashed. This is terrible. Ah, come on! Crap. Well, game over. <laughs> and finally, there's a bit more. The greatest NES games ever. Um, five Academy Award nominations, including Best Picture. Yeah, I think that's from a different DVD case. And yeah, this is a CD-ROM with some footage and photos from some NES games. Yeah, it's terrible. I think you just scratch it a bit. I'm guessing this came with a magazine. Oh uh, yeah, it's not useful. Sorry, two of them. Sorry. Anyhow, I think this might be one of the last items. Let's cross the on a bike. Oops. And, um, oh wait, we've got here things more. Three items here. And they are all air cards. Not all of them, a few. We've got this, the demo. We'll tell you what it's about. Samus, Mario, and Toon Link. Brilliant. And finally, have a good look through this. Teeny tiny turntable. There seems to be the booklet for it. Right. Back to vinyl. Digital download sales have taken a fall over the past few years. Great. Anyhow, that's tell me how to use it. Anyhow, the Jimi Hendrix, these are the favourite albums they know in, in order of release date. So, the Jimi Hendrix Experience. A experience. The Beatles, Abbey Road. Who cares about the fun fact? What's the next one? The Rolling Stones, Exile on Main Street. Pink Floyd, Dark Side of the Moon. Next one is... Elton John, Goodbye Yellow Brick Road. Next is... Bruce Springsteen, Born to Run. Next is... Queen, Night at the Opera. Yep, from a Rex, but it's film. David Bowie, Let's Dance, and number nine, Bob Marley and the Wailers with Legend. Madonna, Like a Virgin. So the newest album on this is 1984. Sure, there wasn't any better ones. I've no, not heard the Madonna one. Anyhow, quite neat. So, all in all, we've got a lot here. A lot, a lot. 
um, good on. We've got a cassette with Roger Rabbit, a, cas a cassette with Jimi Hendrix, some AR codes, Krusty the Clown, and Grandpa Simpson. Some mag random magazine, the yes thing, a cardboard box, a cow, Peter Pay's Phoenix Nights, a Lauren Hardy DVD, a Beatles book, um, a Mr. Potato Head, a chocolate frog box, a Parklife CD. Um, a Reservoir Dogs code and I believe last is a Tato Game Boy. Oh, wasn't that interesting? Thanks for watching. Serve of this hit, you owe me quite a bit.